Welcome back to Council Bluffs News. I'm Zach Arbel and joined in studio by Dana Kim, the board member of the Shannon Clare Theater. Dana, thank you for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you for having me. And coming up this Friday is the um, Halloween at Chanticleer. Can you sure. talk about what that is? Absolutely. So Chanticleer is putting on the production of Dracula. It's a fantastic production based off of Bram Stoker's original novel. Uh, as part of that celebration of putting on Dracula, we're actually putting on a costume party as well as a late night performance of Dracula. So everyone will be released right around midnight. So it'll be especially creepy when they get out of the performance. And how is it that you came up with doing this event with the... Um, Dracula going on. Absolutely. So um, if anybody is familiar with Chanticleer and the theater out there, we obviously um, have a, a history of having some bats uh, that have made their home within the, the oh, really? ceilings and the walls of Chanticleer. So we thought it was very fitting, especially during the Halloween season, to have a production of Dracula. So it's a it's very eerie, very spooky. The, the cast is fantastic. Uh, y the set and the lighting design alone is, is something to be seen. Um, it's been a, pr a fantastic production put together by uh, our director, Dana. But uh, because of the sort of the special season, we've decided between um, the 7.30 and a 10.30 late night performance on October 30th, we're gonna actually throw a costume party with food and beverages and a lot of fun, as well as a costume judging contest. So it'll be a good time for all. And how hard, has, how hard work has it been putting on this performance of Dracula and also with what's going to be going on Friday night? Uh, you know, it, it, it's great because we have such a, a fantastic community here in Council Bluff that love the arts. We have an amazing cast and crew that definitely uh, have enjoyed putting on this production of Dracula. So that part has been easy. The, uh, the planning has been pretty fun as well. So we have a small committee at Chanticleer that has been involved with planning the costume party and the food and drinks, as well as decorating the theater to help, help celebrate the holiday. And how long is Dracula running at the Shannon Clear? It ran the first weekend last weekend. It w uh, ran Friday through Sunday. This will be the closing weekend this weekend. So you can catch performances on Friday and Saturday night at 7, uh, Sunday at, excuse me, s Friday and Saturday at 7.30, and Sunday at 2 o'clock, as well as a special performance, the October 30th at 10.30 at night. And again, in between the 7.30 and the 10.30 performances when we're having that costume party and celebration. And if people want more details about the costume party or about maybe where they can get tickets for Dracula, where can they go to? Absolutely. You can go to the Shannon Clear website. It's shannonclearetheater.com or you can call our phone number 712-323-9955 as well as there's multiple Facebook invites and events that you can find out on, uh, on Facebook. All right, and Nana, thank you for joining us in studio today. Thank you. Stay tuned. More Council Bluffs news coming up right after the break.